the ruling draws three conclusions. Firstly, the Swiss Co's goodwill amortization is a deduction without inclusion hybrid mismatch arrangement. Secondly, the effect of that hybrid mismatch arrangement was imported into Italy by the purchase consideration paid by the Italian Co to the Swiss Co. And thirdly, Although both of these companies are members of a US M&E group, and although the subpart F rules include the Swiss Co's income in the US parent company's US tax base, that inclusion did not qualify as an equivalent adjustment under the Italian legislation which transposes the ATAD hybrid rules.